Eventually, we want to distribute the static site to other developers. Realistically, we don't want developers to download 154 files. We need to find an action that will combine all of these files into a compressed folder for a distribution online. Looking at our release step, we have an artifact with 154 files and we cannot expect our developers to download 154 files individually. The common course of action is to create a compressed folder or a zip folder with 154 files in it and then make that available for download online. So if we go to our GitHub Actions organization and look for a first party action, if we look for a compress or zip or archive, we really don't see anything that's available first party. But we can jump over to the GitHub Marketplace, which is a marketplace of free and paid actions that are built by everyone. We can search for actions specifically and type in keywords like zip and find actions built by others that can perform the task we want. Now, I'm going to select this zip release action. It seems to be pretty popular and um, seems to fit what I'm trying to accomplish here. Um, it's just like the first party actions. It has a organization slash repository name format. You can always jump to the GitHub repository if you want to learn how it's structured. Um, it has a at symbol with the version name based upon the current branch, which here the version name would be master branch. So, um, essentially to use it, you don't have to specify any properties after the with keyword. But um, I'm going to keep it simple. I'll probably specify a file name and nothing else. So using the Dr. Zero zip release at master branch seems to be what I need to use this third party um, to use this third party action. OK, let's give it a shot. So we're going to go in and we are going to go to release project and we are going to create a new step to archive our content. So name archive site content uses this action with file name site.zip we'll save it here and there we go there's our integration yaml updated and we are going to implement archiving of content we'll commit the change and sync it to our remote repository We'll go back into GitHub to our GitHub action. We'll just jump back in and let it build and release real quick. We use a little bit of um, video magic to speed this process up. All right, now that we are done, we're gonna go into the release project job. Look at the archive site content step and see that it took all 154 files and created a zip archive called the site.zip and added all of the files and deflated them quite a bit. So this was a successful implementation for us.